what is up you guys welcome back to my channel in today's video guys we're gonna be reviewing a movie called namaste wahala it literally just came out it came out on february 14th so not that far away but yeah we're gonna be reviewing i'm gonna give you guys the good and bad and what i liked and what i did and what i didn't like about the movie to my channel don't forget to subscribe and yeah without further ado let's get right into the video okay so this movie i don't even know where to start it's a nollywood movie um it's about this girl who meets this indian guy and well they fall in love and you already know what comes next but yeah i don't really want to explain the movie to you guys i want to get you guys um i want to get your opinion so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna play the the, the movie trailer namaste wahala i'm gonna play the movie trailer somewhere here or here i'm gonna play it we're gonna watch it together and then i'll tell you guys my review on the movie so yeah let's watch the trailer and when we're done watching the trailer i have a question for you guys at the end and it's playing right now this is raj my cousin and he's an investment banker and he's single and this is Didi. She's a sweetheart. She's pretty. She's a lawyer. And he's not she's ugly very, either. very single. If it's meant to be, it's meant to be. I'm going to marry you. Excuse me? Eh, Didi, listen. You think it's easy to find who wants to buy what you're selling? You better brace up. You're lucky. Such wonderful news. Who is he? Where is he from? I'm Raj. <laughs> you can't just go to your in-laws' house just like, like let them know you are one of us. Blend in. <laughs> let me walk right into the lion's den. You should have at least prepped them. Ma, what is it? Yes, I'm in Nigeria. So I've the reached. mom doesn't like her. Her parents no, don't this like is her. Madness. No, 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 just like I did yours. <laughs> oh, so cool. Okay. So that was the movie trailer. Now my question to you guys is what you think about the trailer? Did it pull you in? Because it did for me. When I saw this trailer, guys, I was like, this movie is gonna be the bomb. It's gonna be like wow it's gonna be so good y'all had so i had like a really high expectation towards this movie um i watched the trailer like beginning of february and i was like i can't wait for this movie to go on netflix like i was checking my netflix every day when this movie came out i mean before this movie was on netflix i was a uh, geeked i was hyped i couldn't wait so it pulls up on netflix i'm watching it and my ha i happened to have my siblings at my house and I was like, guys, let's watch this movie. Oh my gosh, and I must well, is on Netflix now. Yay! I watched it. 20 minutes into the movie, I was like, okay, no, mm -mm. no, they're lying. No, no, mm -mm. Ew. oh my gosh, this movie, this movie, oh my gosh, wow. First of all, the one thing I like about it was like the, you know, inter inter interracial, interracial couple aspect of it was nice. Like, people need to be more open minded. But other than that, the movie was um boring. I'm sorry, but this movie was it wasn't like whoa and it wasn't like eh. it was like I don't know. It wasn't I feel like everything was rushed, you know, like this dude that comes out of nowhere, um, meets her, says he's gonna marry her as soon as he sees her, literally says it out loud. He didn't think, he just said it out loud. And boys, please don't ever, 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 ever tell a girl you're gonna marry them when you just met them. Just think in your head, but do not say it out loud because that's just chasing them away, okay? Anyway, let's get back to the movie. This movie, <laughs> it wasn't, everything was rushed. It was predictable. Like, they meet, they're gonna, obviously, family, um, they're gonna have some family tension because 
they're different cultures the parents want the girl to marry a uh, nigerian or whatever culture she is guy and the indian guy mom his mom wants him to marry a beautiful indian girl so obviously they're gonna be touching on that it was so predictable it wasn't that funny the only funny part that my brother likes is when uh the indian guy i i always forget names i never remember anybody's name in a movie the indian guy black friend told him you can't just pull up to your in-laws like that you gotta bring them something you gotta bring them some beer and some and then he said goat when he said goat they had like a goat sound in the background it was like bah. it was the funniest thing but other than that the movie was predictable it was rushed I felt like it took three minutes to make that movie. Honestly, I felt like it was a iPhone made movie. Like, don't get me wrong, the quality was crispy, but it's just it was quick. Like, I like the um whoever wrote this movie was really like basic. Like, we're gonna do one, two, three, four, and the movie is done. I was expecting more. I was like, I wish they didn't rush um their love because it was rushed. Like, no, it was rushed, but yeah the movie really was just not it i they were making it um nollywood slash bollywood like uh so what i mean is like if you ever seen an, Ind an indian movie they sing literally all the time over everything as soon as he falls in love he sings she breaks his heart he sings a bullet shot they sing fighting they sing yeah so anyways they sing a lot in their movies so they tried to take that aspect and put it in this movie um let's just okay let's just keep the singing apart um with just bollywood movies because that's just not it mm -mm. the singing men and then they were like dancing and he was singing about how much he likes her <laughs> I was like, this is so cringy. Oh my god, it's so cringy. They're trying to add that into this movie. I don't know. <laughs> it was, yeah, it was just cringy for me. And I was just like, mm, how about we don't sing and just move on with the movie? Because it's already boring enough. So let's just keep going. Let's just keep it pushing, baby. Just keep it pushing, please. No, no songs, no songs. No, 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 no. Because, mm -mm. like, the Nollywood movies I watch. There is no singing, so I'm used to that, right? So when they brought singing, I was like, no, please, no, no, no singing. Some people might like the singing part, but for me, it was a no. It was a, it wasn't, it's a no for me. Okay, it's a no. Mm -mm. Yeah, I, yeah, I just, I just watched it just cause, but I didn't really like it that much. It was just there. It was, it didn't give me, you know, like yes this is the movie no yeah that's the only thing i gotta say about this movie but the trailer though i'm uh, man i gotta give you credit for the trailer the trailer pulled me in you know what i'm saying it pulled me all the way all the way in but the movie was like oh pushed me away you know what i'm saying anyway i don't even know where this review is going i'm just saying that if i were to rate this movie from one to ten it would be mm, Okay, let's give it a pass because it wasn't horrible, horrible. There's worse movies like um, To the Boys Ever Loved. There's worse, okay? So I'm going to give this movie a 50. Or if it's between 40 and 50. But yeah, that's my review about this movie. If you haven't watched it and I ruined it for you, I'm sorry. Yikes. Um, but if you want to watch it, watch it. It's... It's a good movie. <laughs> Anyways, that's the end of this video. I hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next movie review. I wonder what movie I'm going to be reviewing next. But anyways, I'm going to get going. Bye, guys. Much love. Peace.